is in the air, the flowers are blooming, Easter is upon us. Yeah, no, it's really true. And clearly Two-Tone and Pink Bear are in the middle of an intensive conversation here. I can't believe you've never heard of it. What? Are you kidding me? Is this real? Two-Tone has never ever heard of the Easter Dino. What? Me? What? Don't tell me that you've never heard of the Easter Dino either. I can't say that I have, Pink Bear. Oh, man. Yeah, I've, I me mean neither. I know. Well, no, I, I don't know where he got that. Oh, anyway, you know what? Let's focus on the story at hand, which is not an Easter dino, but an Easter cool cat, perhaps? That's right, Pete the Cat, big Easter adventure. And, you know, the coolest cat around... Of course, he likes to get in on all the holiday action. And here he is already diving into a basket of eggs. Uh, we have a bit of a floral field here going, so. Okay, all right, all right, flowers. I'm just going to read on top of you. It's fine, right? Pete was excited. Easter was here. He couldn't wait for his basket of goodies. Jelly beans were his favorite. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. His basket was empty, except for a note. Pete, please help. Find the eggs, paint the eggs, hide the eggs. Thanks, the Easter Bunny. P.S. Where are these? Wait, what? Is the bunny just taking the holiday off? Because that's, that's an awkward time for the Easter Bunny to take off, which would be precisely when he's needed. Oh, okay, so Pete is being very game about this, and Hop, boing, 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 is wearing the ears. Pete put on the bunny ears and thought, a cat with ears like a bunny. Now that's funny. But it looks good on him. Well, uh, aren't you gonna do it? I'm sorry, do what, Pink Bear? But put on the ears. Well, I don't, um, I don't have bunny ears. You must have something, and you have a lot of stuff. Okay, okay, let me see. Um, okay, would, would, would this work? No. Okay, okay. Um, okay, like, oh, 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 I've got a, I've got a unicorn horn. Nope, that won't work. Okay, okay, okay. Um, oh, hey, uh, ha happy birthday. Nope, 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 you gotta have something that looks like ears. Okay, um, well, okay, these are llama ears. That'll work. Oh, um, okay, uh, what if I wear them th like this, like backwards maybe? Do you think that'll work better? Yeah, that'll work exactly right. Okay, put them on. I mean, you have to be, uh, just, just like Pete the Cat, okay? Okay, okay, I'll be, um, all right, uh, let me just get some, uh, all right, right? They're llama ears, really, but, hey, you know what? You know what? We improvised. Happy Easter, chickens! Do you have any eggs today? Pete asked. I'm helping the Easter bunny. Sure, Pete, whoa, whoa, whoa. we have lots of eggs, the chicken said. We are happy to help, but don't you need a bunny nose and a fluffy bunny tail? Valid question. Okay, ever since when have we had a chicken around here? Okay, okay, and there's a fox chasing the chicken since what? Where did the fox come from? What? The chickens were right. A bunny nose and a tail would be neat. Then Pete's costume would be complete. So you're getting some cotton and gluing it together and a little snip and a little dip and a little blah, 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 and boom. Pete put on the nose and tail like a bunny's. A cat dressed up like a bunny. Now that's funny. Now. Pete was ready. It was getting late, and he still had a lot of eggs to decorate. What colors would Pete use? Hop, hop, bitty, hop, hop, hop. Off to the tool shed for paints and brushes. Ah, to the tool shed where we have a giant lawnmower, some nails, a saw, screws, and lots of things that look super duper safe. Pete couldn't wait to paint the eggs. Some eggs had a one color. Uh, some eggs had a two, some eggs were red, and some eggs were blue. Not to mention the green and the yellow and the infinite combinations you can get when you mix the colors. When the egg painting was done, Pete had a basket full of bright, colorful, amazing eggs. Now hiding them would be lots of fun. 
he did a really good job. Check it out. Some of them are have these little uh, squiggly lines, and some of them have just regular stripes, and then some of them have tone-on-tone -tone polka dots, and then some of them are just solid colors. Nice variety. Very nicely done for an amateur Easter bunny. But where, oh where, would Pete hide the big beautiful basket of eggs around the neighborhood for all his friends to find? So obviously he put one right by the bike and one in the window and one on top of the tree, good luck, and one at the bottom of the tree and another one in this window and then one right next to the house and oh, one by the chimney, that one Santa will find in seven months. Pete hid eggs in flower pots. He hid them in the water spout. And when he was done hiding the eggs, Pete the cat was all worn out. Helping others out is what Easter is all about, Pete said. And Pete's job was done. He was hiding the last one. When ba ba ba, the Easter bunny arrived. Okay, Easter bunny, what up? You totally dropped the ball, or dropped the egg, so to speak, on Easter and left all the work for Pete the cat? Like, what were you doing? Any explanation? No, no, you're just gonna look at us with those big googly eyes like that? Okay, fine. All right, I won't ask anymore. Great job, Pete. You are a big help, said the Easter Bunny. The Easter Bunny gave Pete an award for a job well done. Number one helper. Really, he just like did the whole job. He didn't just help you, he did the whole thing. But, okay, I'm sure he had a valid reason. Helping others can be lots of fun. Happy Easter, everyone. Oh, I guess the point was that, that Easter, he, he, the Easter Bunny taught Pete the cat a lesson. That must be it about being helpful. And also, now Pete's egg decorating skills are off the charts. But wait, what, what is this? Oh! <gasps> Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, look at this. There's a there's a poster in here, a whole Pete the Cat poster. So the book is uh, is, is awesome, and then you get a poster with it, and, and there it's perforated to open it. Okay, you know, I'm not gonna do it right now because I'm gonna need a, a grown up to help me with that. And then, wait, 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 there's more. We have stickers that you can put anywhere, including any Easter egg you wanna decorate. and. Then, there's still more stuff. This is like an Easter basket of goodies inside of this book. Because look at that. Cards, Easter cards too from, that you can give to your friends and write, and, and, and a second page of cards. <gasps> Kid, this is a whole lot of great stuff in here. Oh yeah, look at that. It includes 12 Easter cards, a fold up poster and stickers. Maybe I, did, I missed that in the middle of the whole, um, Easter dino thing. <laughs> you saw that, right? See, I told you. I'll never doubt you again either, Pink Bear. See, I knew it. The Easter dino has come to bring the eggs. I better go find them. Okay, I'm gonna go, I wanna go see what an Easter dino egg looks like too. All right, kid, happy Easter from all of us at Kid Time Storytime and may your basket always be full.